Welcome to my video. In the next three minutes, I will talk you through the prototype and design of eddy current braking system as part of my second year individual project. Essentially, this type of braking system uses electromagnetism principles in order to produce a retarding torque to the wheel. And because it's frictionless, therefore it could solve problems caused by conventional braking systems such as brake wear and low brake performance on high speed region. For the power supply, we've got three AA batteries here, which uh, is mounted on the battery holder that has on and off switch button. So when we switch it on, it allows the current to flow and power the DC motor. The DC motor will then induce a mechanical force, and we use two different sizes of timing pulleys to transmit the rotational motion from the shaft of the DC motor to the axle of the wheel. The braking unit involves a simple lever system, which allows us to adjust the position of the magnet relative to the rotating disc. Notice that the magnet is not making any contact with the rotor. And at zero speed, the magnet does not attract the disc since copper is a non-ferrous and non-magnetic material. Two pieces of green paper are used to show how fast the disc is moving. After the power is switched on, the disc starts to rotate and reach a high velocity. However, when the neodymium magnet is brought nearby the rotating disc, the wheel starts to decelerate. This is due to the formation of eddy currents within the conductor that creates a magnetic field, which by Lenz law, act to oppose the motion of the wheel. We will see it once again. Here we can observe the rapid braking response which causes the wheel to slow down and reach a lower velocity.